If you've stumbled across my channel, you probably have also seen other Christian content and where they have war rooms and prayer rooms, special designated rooms set up for you to do all of your praying and your hardcore studying and just really getting into the word. And if you're like me, you're looking at these videos and you're like, oh, I really, really need a war room. Where in my house can I set aside a special place where I can pray and read the Bible and do my studies? Well, you might already have one. <laughs> I realized I already had a prayer room. I didn't need to stress out or feel like I wasn't doing enough because I didn't have this designated area. And I'm gonna show it to you right now. So I just decided to do this from the entrance. So here we go. As we enter, I have this little nook here. That's actually a painting my husband painted and I put it in here in my blue room. Uh, but we have the cross in the entrance. And then here, and I have my little Holy Spirit candle. That is my display Bible here. And this is the sitting room. I sit here often and read the Bible. I'll do studies or I'll just read because it's a very comfortable chair. And this is mostly the quietest room in the house as far as downstairs, but this is a very comfortable, relaxing room. And I really enjoy sitting here and doing my Bible studies, just studying the Bible, reading the word. And over here, this, let me back up some more, is where we do homeschool and I make most of my videos. And when I really, really want to study, this is where I lay out all of my Bibles and get out my notebooks and just really, really study. It is not the cleanest and most organized, but this is what it is. I have my bookshelves full of theology, commentaries, all kinds of learning material involved in the Bible, and I have my crafting stuff and some games. And then over here in the corner, I have family games. This is where I store them. Don't really have anywhere else right now. And just more homeschool supplies and Bible journaling supplies. All of my stuff for studying. And this is the seat I sit in when I really get to studying. And then that is my view. So this whole time I'm sitting in this room doing all of this stuff and then it just hits me like I have a room. I don't need to make a room. <laughs> it just happened on its own. This room has evolved into where I do most of my studies. So if you don't have a designated war room or prayer room, please don't stress yourself out about it and feel like you have to have it because all of these people online have it and it's, you know, what we're supposed to do and we're supposed to have a room and it's supposed to be the war room, it's supposed to be the prayer room, yada, yada, yada. Your whole house can become that or part of your house like mine did and I didn't even realize it because here I was thinking I need to find a place. I need to have a place. This, 
I need a war room. I want, I didn't need it. I wanted it, right? <laughs> and then it hit me. This is the prayer room. This is where I do all of my studies. I even make my videos here. Like, this is just what it is. The back of the house back here. That is the family room. That is the kitchen over here. Family room back here. Uh, the little eating area or whatever. That is where all of the chaos ensues. <laughs> but in here, this is my calm, serene, blue, relaxing room that I just discovered is already my war room. And you see that sign? Sorry if it's shaking. I'm using the, uh, the little handheld selfie stick. It's usually on a tripod, but that there that is my war room sign that i had my husband paint me he's really good at painting letters if y'all have ever tried painting letters you know it is hard but my husband he can paint some letters so i was like paint me a sign that says war room <laughs> because this is my war room and i just i want a little sign so there we go don't stress yourself out about it. You probably already have a room. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any questions, please comment down below and I will answer to the best of my ability. And as always, I am so glad that you're here. If you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, please do so so that we can help each other in our faith and our walk with God. Bye guys.